Hello all, welcome to this video. I am Divya from Informatica Global Customer Support. In this video, I will walk you through the use cases of enterprise data preparation. We are going to talk about broad spectrum of data analytics, overview of enterprise data preparation, its use cases and short use case demo. So what is data analysis? Data analysis is, a def is defined as a process of cleaning, transforming and modeling data to discover useful information for business decision making. There are different types of analytics that we can do. Descriptive, diagnostic, predictive and prescriptive analysis. Descriptive analysis describe, summarize the existing data using existing business intelligence tool to better understand what is going on or what has happened in my organization. Diagnostic analysis focus on past performance to determine what happened and why the result of analytics is often an analytic dashboard. Predictive analytics emphasize on predicting the possible outcome using statistical model and machine learning techniques. Prescriptive analysis is a type of predictive analysis that is used to recommend one or more course of action on analyzing the data. So overall, we can do four kind of analytics in an organizational data. Now, let's discuss about the personas. So these are all the user personas. These are the personas who interact with data while uncovering and deploying insight as they explore the organizational data. Data stewards are responsible for defining, implementing policies and procedure for day-to-day -day operational and administrative management of systems and data. Data analyst is an individual who is responsible to gather, investigate and represent data and filter out useful information from it. Data engineers are individuals whose primary job responsibility involve preparing data for analytical and operational users. So they build mapping to provide the data in required format by the analyst. So their primary customer are analysts. So they do data cleansing, transformation on the data, etc. Data architects define on how the data will be stored, consumed and integrated and managed by different data entities, IT system, as well as any application. So, analysts want to do some analysis. They will provide their requirement for the data to do the analysis to the data engineer. For example, to take any business decision where to build their new data warehouse based on the past customer orders. So, they will provide their requirement to the data engineer who will create a mapping to read the customer table, order table, and prepare the tables and provide it to the analyst. So basically, the data engineer will perform join on the two table, apply some logical transformation, load the table to the required target, and provide the target table information to the analyst to do some analytical works. This process will take time. The data engineers need to understand the requirement, build the mapping, do quality validation on the mapping, then they need to load it to the target, get approval from the analyst that it is the required data that they want to uh, do for analysis. And then they will run the mapping with production data and get the final table. As multiple teams are involved, and it will take time to arrive at the final table with which the data analyst can take a business decision or use it for analysis. So if we make anal analysts to do the preparation and have the data they need, it will reduce the turnaround time to do this activity. So in enterprise data preparation, we provide an environment where analysts can prepare the data they need. When the final data is available, they can do a publish on the worksheet, which will create a mapping in the backend to load the data into the target with required transformations and joins in place. So minimal effort is required by the analyst to adopt this product. So EDP primary users will be data analysts. So with enterprise data preparation, analysts can spend more time on analysis and less time on finding and preparing the data. So enterprise data preparation on whole is collaborative self-service big data discovery and preparation solution for data analysts to turn raw data into insights with quality and governance. So overall, with enterprise data preparation, the data analyst can perform these operations and arrive at the final table or final result, which he, can, he or she can use it 
for making any business decision. Now let's jump on to a quick use case demo. So this is the uh, enterprise data preparation UI homepage. So if analyst or user can want to create a new project, so he'll be able to create from here. So I have already created a new project. So we need to search for an asset to add into the project. So I have got information that it is available in the customer table. Customer table is available under high VDL resource and schema is DB. So we have to go here and search for that high VDL uh, resource and schema DD to arrive at the tables. So I have already opened. So we'll be able to do a data preview on these tables to verify that these are the valid data and add it to the project. So I have got the customers and orders tables uh, added to the project. So now let's do the prepare. So this is a sample preview of the customers. So you can uh, select for the filters if you want to apply any filters, sampling size, anything, and load the data into the worksheet. Similar way for the orders table, we have to load the data. So these are the sampling data that we have. And then uh, we can perform join, union, lookup, aggregate pivot, and pivot function, filters, apply a new formula for the worksheet, apply any rule, window function, etc. So here, uh, what we'll do is we'll uh, do a join on the worksheet, customers and orders. So I'm going to do a inner join, join the worksheet. So once this is done, you'll be able to see the results here. So when you click on the address, it will show the value frequencies as well. So from this, you will be able to understand like how many number of occurrence it had got. So this region has got five occurrence and the other region has one occurrence. So based on this, this is a target table. For example, this is the target table that the analyst wants. So once all these uh, transformation, whatever logical transformation you want to apply, formulas, rules, etc. Once you arrive at a target table, close the prepare screen. So, uh, for example, if this is the target table that you want to publish and use it for uh, later analysis, then do a publish from here. You can select whatever schema you want to publish and then the high table name. And then publish the data. So once the worksheet is published, you can use the table for doing further analytics. So we would love to hear feedback from you. So please do the needful. Thank you for your time. Bye.